My name is Jackie Carnes, and growing up with a mother with epilepsy has not been easy. As a teenager, my father passed away and left me to be the sole provider and caretaker for my mom. For those of you who are unfamiliar, the medication alone to control seizures can cost thousands of dollars a month. I would sell my clothes, furniture, even mine and my mom's jewelry just to pay for her medication. As the years passed, it seemed like her seizures were more frequent and the side effects from the medications were just getting worse. The fear you have as a caretaker is very real. You fear not knowing when the next one will take place, how long it will be, how many there will be. You fear them falling or accidentally hurting themselves from something as simple as holding something sharp or hot, and that's just the tip of the iceberg. However, connecting with the Epilepsy Foundation of Michigan has completely changed my mom's quality of life and mine. She's not just existing anymore, she's living and thriving. The foundation gave us the tools and resources we needed and connected us with the top doctors in the US. None of that would have been possible without people like you supporting the foundation. Your giving directly affects the lives of those suffering from epilepsy. Look within yourself and know that you have the ability to directly change someone's life forever and give them a new meaning to the word hope. Hello, my name is Matthew Sutchin and I have had epilepsy since I was seven years old. I'm now 29 and married. Uh, I just bought a house with my wife and uh, we still live with my epilepsy. Luckily, I have amazing people surrounding me with my family and friends and my wife and she has learned to deal with it over the past many years and deal with it kind of just means that we have made a new normal. Um, we only, you know, have one car and, and we've just learned to live with that uh, because we don't have any drive that often. Um, I work from home at times and that's just part of uh, what our new normal is like. Your life uh, is a bit, a bit different, but um, that's why this resource is like uh, the Epilepsy Foundation of Michigan. Uh, they are a great resource to find out information about epilepsy. Uh, it's also a great resource to find out more about your epilepsy, about different medicines, about a resource on how to help you uh, in your normal life. My name is Heather Maurer, and I'm the proud mama to three beautiful children, Mia, Emerson, and Timmy. Like so many, my husband Tim and I found ourselves faced with a terrifying fear during the very early hours of St. Patrick's Day 2013. We were experiencing something we knew nothing of. Our Emmy, just shy of two years old, was having her first seizure. After a 911 call and an ambulance ride, we were told that Emmy had a febrile seizure. But she'd be fine. Nothing to worry about. We were sent home, and after confirmation from our pediatrician, we didn't give it a second thought. Epilepsy was not on our radar. Thankfully, Emmy was fine. Until Christmas Eve 2014, when she was rushed to the hospital yet again. Only this time, it was much worse. Upon arrival at the hospital, our sweet Emmy suffered massive, uncontrollable back-to-back -back seizures. In the world of epilepsy, this is referred to as status epilepticus and is incredibly dangerous. In the emergency room, the doctors weren't sure if they could help her. We were quickly ushered out when doctors began shouting that they were losing our little girl. After spending what seemed like an eternity in that hospital and awaiting results on a countless number of tests, our three-year-old was diagnosed with epilepsy. To say that we were in shock is an understatement. The fear, worry, and unanswered questions began to spiral out of control. That's when we reached out to the only person we knew who had experience with this disease, Angie May. Without hesitation, Angie immediately led us to the Epilepsy Foundation of Michigan. We were given a wealth of information, access to 24-7 helplines, and directed to the most incredible team of specialists. Our questions soon found answers, 
and our daughter continues to be a strong little warrior thanks to their support. When living with epilepsy, the fear never really goes away. However, there is this wonderful feeling of solace just knowing that you can count on this group of individuals who are fighting the fight right alongside you. They share a deep understanding of exactly what you're going through. The time, care, and commitment that this foundation provides to the epilepsy community and beyond is overwhelming, which is exactly why they need your support. One out of every 26 people in the United States will be diagnosed with epilepsy within their lifetime. Your support will provide the foundation the opportunity to continue to do the good work that they do each day through educational and supportive services. I'm happy to say that after years of medication and testing, Emmy has been seizure free since that horrific day in December. We know that this can change in the blink of an eye and we are always on guard, but regardless, we will never stop fighting for a cure. Together with your support, we will find a way to reach the goal of not another moment lost to seizures. Hi everyone, my name is Emmy Mowell and I just like to say the Epilepsy Foundation of Michigan is super amazing and they have helped my family so much. Your support is greatly appreciated.